Hey everybody, this is Cameron from Bird Barrier here to talk to you today about the new Solar Sticks. This is a great new product that is used to keep birds from getting under solar panels. Up here you have our traditional system we've been selling for many years, which is the metal mesh and the plastic clips which clip onto the solar panel, protrude out through, you slide on this disc and lock this in place. The Solar Sticks is different in that it's a complete unit. There's no mesh required to be cut it comes in um, almost 20 inch length. It can cover anywhere from about a six inch gap, six inch to three inch gap between. And it would just basically go onto the front of the solar panel like that. It would be taped or glued, which we'll talk about in a minute. The nice thing about solar sticks is that these stainless steel rods can push up inside, which means it can be adjustable to different heights and different shapes. So I'm gonna show you right here, this is Spanish tile. That's very difficult to usually install solar panels to, but if you put this down on here like this, you can see the rods go up and down and they perfectly conform to this shape, any shape. If it was just a, a pipe sticking out from under the, uh, the solar panel, it would just go over the pipe as it's going over my arm like that. So that's the beauty of this. They're super fast and easy to install. Um, they're a complete module ready to go. And now we're gonna talk about how to install them on solar panels. So here you can see a nice average size gap and the sticks can protect the gap from six inches to three to six inches in this space right here. So the way that works is you would just put it on, lower it down, and when it gets to the flush with the panel, that's where you wanna secure it. So securing it to the solar panel is something that really needs to be discussed because you don't want to put holes in here with screws. We did that over here on this end just to show how that could work. Um, we ran three self-tapping screws through here and there is an open channel on the back, but many solar panel manufacturers uh, might void the warranty if you put screw holes into their materials. So even though this seems like the way to do it and there are screw holes here, those are also for glue, and we really recommend that only using screws as a last resort, and only if you have written permission from the building owner or homeowner or somebody taking responsibility if there's ever a problem with that in the future. So having said that, um, the best way to secure this onto this flat surface is with this tape, which is 3M5925 acrylic foam tape. It's really, really strong stuff. In fact, we installed this about a month ago with it. And, you know, I'm pulling really hard and I do not think this is gonna come off of here. Um, it's, it's sandwiched in between the black plastic, so it's not gonna get much sun on it. Um, and this has a long life expectancy from 3M. It's a great product. So the way to put it on, you see we have a nice flat surface here on the back of this sticks, is to first wipe it down with, um, rubbing alcohol or one of these treated um, treated uh, little towel things. So we're gonna wipe it down with the alcohol and we're gonna wipe down the part. This is gonna remove all contaminants, oil residues, anything like that, as you can see there. And we're gonna let it dry for a second. So we'll be back when that's dry and we'll apply it. Okay, this is dry now. So we're gonna take the 3M tape and apply it to the top of the part. Use a pair of scissors to cut. You want a nice clean end at each end if you can. So now I'm just gonna peel this back and I'm gonna pull against the angle of the tape so it doesn't lift it off if it is so inclined to. So there it is, totally secured on the top. And now you just bring it over and ease it down into position. And now press it up against the panel. Press it down nice and hard. And this stuff actually takes about 24 hours to cure fully. So um, don't go on and start tugging it hard until the next day. The nice thing about Solar Sticks too is it's got perforated lines between each section. So if I was doing this piece here and I had to end it right here, I just simply break it back top and bottom, go back and forth a few times, 
and it breaks on that line. And now I simply attach this piece on this corner and we're all set. The last way that you can apply uh, these two is to the um, panel is with bird barrier bond. And so I would do the same thing. I'd wipe it down with the alcohol on the part and on the surface and then just apply it. I'm not going to do it here because I don't want to get glue on the side of our sample, but essentially a small bead of glue along here, bird barrier bond, press it in place. And essentially it's going to hold in place. Um, if you're worried about it falling down, you might apply a, a piece of tape on it to hold it in place while the glue dries. You'd be able to take that tape off within an hour or so, and the product would be nice and secured in there long term. The glue would also come up through the screw holes, which would be a nice extra mechanical grip. So, okay, that's it.